A young wife fell sick and was about to die. If you take care, no young wife will sick, fall sick and die. No plant will fall sick and die. No talent will, will be young and die. No. When you look into the talent, it is enormous. I love you so much. It's a tricky business. All the girls and boys have been told, I love you, I love you, love you. Without knowing what is love, they have not loved themselves. They have not loved their father and mother. Every day when my children called me, they gone to the holidays, they called me. First thing I ask them is, Makle, Appa Madhu Kali Namaskara Madhita. Did you touch your father and mother's feet? Because that is the foundation. Means, as he grows, he knows. Not the feet is important, but the roots of that land, of the trees, whether you watered it. Because if you have not taken care of the roots, you cannot get the fruits. And next thing I ask is, did you kiss them on the cheeks? Then means once you have watered the trees and the plants and you touch the feet, you can see the fruits. And when you eat the fruits, it will be very tasty. You will never ever think that young wife is going to fall sick and die. Yes. I love you so much, she told her husband, I do not want to leave you. Do not go from me to any other woman. If you do, I will return as a ghost and cause you endless trouble. This is what all the politicians said, do not leave my company, do not leave my uh, political party. In Indranagar, I have some political uh, leaders who have seen me as their mistress. <laughs> If I talk to another political leader, Lakshmi Ingres get frightened. He gets, he can create troubles for me. <laughs> if I talk to another person, another person will get fri uh, frightened. They have all sealed you as your own mistress. <laughs> Can you believe? And you live in fear to leave them because if you leave them, what will happen? They will come as a ghost in trouble. Yes, and we are facing some trouble in Indranagar. <laughs> because we are trying to become more independent. You have become a ghost. I, I will return as a ghost and cause you endless trouble. Mm, yes. If I leave this job, they'll give me a pink card. If you give me a pink card, no other company will take me because my name will be in all the companies. Which company? You create your own company. Where you want to go to another jail? You want jail is enough which they threatened you. Swami Suresh Anandji's um, disciple, Renuka called me and told me, throughout the corona time, even though we are shivering, the company, when they give you the yellow pink card, I don't know, and after that, um, Elon Musk took over the Twitter, he started sacking people and every day, even the best leaders in our team were sacked. And every day we are going shivering, thinking we might get the pink card, we might get, and on because of the pink card threat of the ghost, Whatever they say, we start doing because there is no other way. If I lose that, why are you thinking you are losing when you have everything? What you have was a slave trade which is stopping you from your growth. This has created the psychological damage where most of the hospitals came up, gymnasiums came up, karate clubs come up. Are this why you wanted all those clubs when you yourself is strong yes soon the voice passed away the husband respected her last wish for the first three months but then he met another woman and fell in love with her they became engaged to be married and three months after the after you left the company after you left the school or college after you left the friend uh, friends who are disturbing you three months after it is still in my mind if i leave the company will i be respected where will I have my job? Where will I get my salary? Whether my wife, my children will respect me? Whether my friends will respect me because I have a school dropout, a college dropout. But all those time, what enforces and we pro teaches the children after giving them pink card is, don't worry, don't worry, be happy. But there is no happiness. Don't worry means now you go to Australia, you go to England, UK. You go to Canada and you take an MBA. MBA costs only 20 lakhs, 50 lakhs, 60 lakhs, 80 lakhs. So all the money what they saved, dump it over there. You learn and bring the degree, you you will be getting another job. Always get engaged. Huh? But they are only teaching you to throw your money, not to go back to look into your strength. 
your MBA is inside. When uh, um, Satya Sai Baba, Sai Darshan people came to my Indranagar school, and uh, one person who was doing the uh, um, Satya Narayana, oh, what, what he calls um, that ser serving of the food, Na Narayan Seva, he came and said, oh, Guruji, I want to introduce my son. And so he said, This is my son. And they said, Hi, how are you? And he said, I'm Ajit Venkatraman. And uh, from, I said, Oh, Ajit, how are you? I'm Rakum. I said, um, so Ajit, what are you doing? You said, I'm an MBA from Michigan University. I said, MBA from Michigan University? I'm an SBA from Bangalore. And he said, SBA. What is that SBA? I said, Street Business Administration. <laughs> street Business Administration. Whatever people come and talk on the street, I listen, I put it up, blackboard, I wrote, we children need. <laughs> from there, we built up our school. You can become an SBA, Street Business Administrator. Why are you going running out an MBA in Australia by throwing 20 likes? Don't you have? You got a space, a time. It was good. You got a pink card to come back to your family, build up your joint family. There you find thousands and thousands of crores of happiness, love, and power.